Okay, so this is going to be a uh, CCT stack mat. Little quick screencast thing. Um, okay, so right now uh, I have pretty much everything you need to open. I have Prisma uh, timer, Prisma puzzle timer over here, CCT, here's the CCT uh, options. Um, and then this is the Mac OS uh, sound system panel. Um, so you want to go into that <coughs> and you look in your line in so you want to make sure you're not plugged into a headphone jack or anything else or you, you don't want to be using the internal microphone in the laptop because that's obviously not going to be picking up your stack mat so um you have to check the line in right now the stack mat's off and see what happens when i turn it on you can see right in here uh there's signal coming in to uh, mac os so at macOS is seeing the stack mat, um, and it's not too high, not too low, just loud enough that there's no distortion or anything. Um, okay, so then here in CCD, looking at our mixers, we have our built-in input and our built-in microphone. We want to be picking the built-in input because that's the this line in that we have the stack mat coming into. Um, so mine was already picked, so I will click save. And as you can see, um, it says timer is on already. Now if I turn it off, timer's off. So C CCT is seeing it. And now if we go into Prisma timer, um, you go to stack mat trigger, or stack mat timer input device, and you have your built-in input and your built-in microphone. Obviously you're not picking the microphones, so we're going to pick the input, and then timer trigger is the stack mat timer. So now, this doesn't show you the same um, kind of information, but it will show the time. So start the timer. You can see both CCT and Prisma are gathering the uh, time data. And I stop it, and there you go. Um, so yeah, it's working both in Prisma and CCT at the same time. Plus, um, it works sign. Uh, in the system uh, sound panel as well so uh, yeah I guess that's it uh, working I uh, stack my timer working with both Prisma and CCT at the same time